Hey, what's up? It's Chanel. Welcome to a new episode of Vital Vinyl Vlog. Today, thank you to Pat Hopkins for making today's video possible. He actually hooked up this French death metal EP by Putrefiance Left to Decay EP 2020 on Metal is the Law Records. This is the second cassette pressing, number 48 out of 100. And first off, just look at that logo and the cover art. Fan fucking tastic. Very classic and just the way a death metal EP slash demo should look cosmetically. Keeping it fucking simple and going back to one of my favorite bands, Abhorrence. And a special demo right there. That demo is to me like one of those demos that, you know, really encapsulated the band sound. And this does the same because just by looking at the cover and the logo, you should know you're getting in for some fucking dismal nothing but really meat and potatoes death metal this is fucking cool shit three tracks around 17 minutes of death and you know it legit sounds fucking awesome but yeah the only bummer is i know this is sold out and stuff and you get three tracks Unholy Procession, Age of Agony, and Left to Decay. I was actually surprised to find out these gentlemen were French. I really thought, you know, like, they were either from the Kill Town area. Because, like, it did remind me a, a lot of the latest Engulfed and the Engulfed demo. I don't know why, it just... It, that was the vibes I was getting, which is why I'm throwing the word dismal out there. Like, it just feels like it's, I don't know. Like, listen to these riffs real quick. Defiance is fucking sick. It brought me back a little bit to actually the Dead Void Looming Spectre demo 2018. Which is like, at first, like, I didn't know these dudes were French. Like, I had no idea <laughs> until I went on their band camp and, uh, like, I looked. I was like, oh fuck, these guys are French. Sick. And because mostly when I hear, you know, extreme metal from France, it's black metal. So it's cool to hear, you know, some really good death metal coming out of France right now. And the fact the dude in the promo photo is wearing a Disastrous Murmur t-shirt. If you watch this channel, you know I love Disastrous Murmur. Fucking Raspides in red and... All well, the demo compilation skinning beginning. I should have got this cassette when I had the chance. I need to get this on cassette. What a killer fucking album. I, I, I love that band so fucking much. But Putrefiance Left to Decay EP. Like, like I said, this is, you know, straightforward fucking pummeling death metal that sounds like the days of old when death metal had that fucking dark evil vibe to it and it sounds great like I, I really like the fucking production and everything here it's just very straight to the point there's no bullshit there's no like fucking at 
atmospheric parts that take up half of the song. Like, it's just fucking awesome. Okay, the program repeats itself. Nice pro tape. And I like the cosmetics here. There's like a skull getting a fucking hatchet to the face. Super fucking sick release right here. Number 48 out of 100. This is the second edition. Badass stuff right here. Thank you to Pat Hopkins for making today's video possible. And this was something that's been on my wish list on Bandcamp for a while. And uh, yesterday we were shipping stuff and he was like, yo, I have a tape for you. I was like, oh, sick. Because I, I I knew what this was because, like I said, I, I didn't know they were from France because I'm an idiot and I didn't really, like, scan down or anything. But, like, somebody sent me this link a little bit ago and I remember being like oh this is awesome and I went back to it a few times and like posted it on um, like patreon and stuff uh, for like morning music and shit but if you're looking for some just like straight forward classic sounding death metal that isn't at all like boof and when I when I'm saying boof I mean like you know, it might look good, but, eh, you know, it, it is what it is sometimes. Like, there's certain releases where the cover art, it looks so fucking awesome. And then you put the album or demo or whatever on and you're like, this is fucking boring. <laughs> this sucks. Or, you know... In this case, holy fucking shit, this band is badass. Like, not only do they have, like, their sound pretty dialed in this, like, very sick way that's, like, cryptic sounding. And what I, what I mean by that is, like, not... I don't like the term cavernous death metal, even though I've used it before, but, like... It has that, you know, a lot of bands have the incantation vibe, and there's nothing wrong with that. And again, normally at the end of the day, it's like, well, I'd rather listen to the real thing, like incantation or like funeral barum, but I love bands like this. Like this reminded me a lot of the direction Pestilent Death is going with their new material. Like, if you haven't heard the new Pestle and Death demo, well, promo, real quick, there is an in incantation cover of fucking Profanation, but, um, really quickly, I just want to show you some similarities, because although Putrefiance hail from France, a lot of their influences, obviously, just by looking at the cover, are Finnish, um, I mean, all I have to do is whip out that abhorrence book and just show you and you'll know exactly what I'm talking about but at the same time so many bands you know that's the way to go when it comes to EPs and demo art either use your logo and a simple design keeping it simple and sick like for example uh, Miserable Creature have a real badass demo cover here it's a little more fancy, but like still super fucking sick. We, in a cursed womb for our first pressing, purposely took a page from Maine's book. Like that was done 100% on purpose for the first press. And then the second pressing, we 
you know, kept it the same, like, you know, we wanted to make it like an old school demo, and I feel like that was accomplished with both presses, like, I'm very happy with that, and, um, there's a lot of bands that just do, like, really fucking sick demo art and stuff, like, Fratricide, for example, also, like, just, I love that fucking shit. Like, just slimy, fucking unreadable logos. Like, these covers have a lot of co a lot in common. Horrible Deformities by Fratricide and Putrefiance Left to Decay, but... Illustration, and that looks like, uh... They might have photocopied that and did it the old school way, which is fucking even sicker. I, I just love that type of shit, you know? But, um, here, I'll let you folks, just in case you have not heard it, I love the new Pestilent Death material. And since I have nothing else to say about putrefiance from France besides fuck yeah... Try and get a copy of Left to Decay, this EP. Three tracks, around 17 minutes of just pure death metal. For fans of death metal. Like, there's no, you know, entombed guitar solos or anything like that. This is straightforward, to the fucking point, death metal. And it's awesome. And that's kind of what Pesto and Death are doing with their newer material. Don't get me wrong, their last record, Chapters of Depravity, is great. But what they have going on now, it's kind of going down the same route as Putrefiance, but Americanized. As you'll hear, Rotted Life Records. vaccination I don't want to spoil it but at the end of the day as sick as that is please don't knock the camera over I apologize I just have to get something real quick everybody at the end of the day has to thank these gentlemen right here between Putrefiance and Incantation is Putrefiance go straight for the fucking jugular. And that's what makes this stand the fuck out. Like I said, it's all killer, no filler. 
sick shit from France, Left to Decay EP by Putrefiance. Get into it. Trust me, that it's so fucking just. It's straightforward, evil sounding death metal. If you don't like it, I'm sorry, but if you do, fucking A. Thank you again, Pat, and thank you folks at home for watching. You fucking rule. Hails.